So if you watched yesterday's vlog, you know that I did my first attempt at making egg bites. So today is the moment of truth. I'm going to heat a couple up, toast some challah bread, and hopefully it worked out. Okay, this is our egg bite moment of truth. They look pretty cute. Um, so we'll see. They're still pretty warm. I'll spare you. That was incredible. You guys should try this. This is really good. I got my olive bread. Mmm. Big win. Hello, welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. We're going to walk through what I'm chose, choosing to wear today. Um, and then we'll kind of move on with the day. I'll tell you kind of what the day looks like a little bit later. Um, but unfortunately, I don't think you're going to be able to tell much separation between the different things. But I'll try and twist for the light. Um, the blazer, I don't know where I got it. I'm sorry. But I've had it for a couple of years, so it's probably long gone by now. This shirt is actually green. Let's see. See, you can see. It's a green velvet. I got it from Jenny, who got it from Madewell. And then these jeans are from American Eagle. And shoes are from Target last year, but I think they still have them. Um, so that's what we're wearing today. We're going to head to the office. Okay, so we are in the car heading to the office. I just wanted to do like my little check-in. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. I'm excited that we're here. Um, we are, today's like one of the rare days where I really just don't know what the day is going to entail because I have a doctor's appointment, our little has a dentist appointment, and then I just have also have like an obscene amount of work. I'm hoping that like my productivity gene kicks in and I can get it all done um, and time for me to also go to the dentist appointment just because I like to um, but it's also not necessary so we'll see how that goes and hopefully I'll be able to come home for lunch I don't I might have to I don't know what's gonna happen so we'll find out either way right now we're heading into the office and it's admin day which just means I am getting all of the boring logistical tasks done, which you'll see. Okay, we are in the office. It took a few minutes when I got here to just like breathe and um, plan out my tasks for the day. So here's kind of how I've categorized them in order to get my mission done. My goal is to go to the dentist with board, to be able to be home for lunch, and I want to not feel rushed and hectic. So, but I also want to get everything on my list done. So in order to do that, I have prioritized my tasks for in order of like what needs to happen here, like in the office, like things that have to be done here, things that I would prefer to do here. So those are number two. And then things that either should be done or can easily be done at home. So that way, if I knock out all the tasks that have to be done here first, then I can move on to the tasks that I would prefer to be done here and then the rest can be done at home. So um, I have, it's 9 a.m. Ford's dentist appointment is at 11. I imagine we will leave around 10.30. So I have an hour and a half to go through and really knock out all of the things that have to be done here, which is getting today's Vlogmas video finished and up the one that goes live today, um, printing return ship address labels, um, and recording three, they're kind of short workshops for um, Enneagram and relationships. They're already written, the graphics already exist, I just have to do the recording of them. Um, and then we move into like budgeting tasks, new bullet journal spreads, 
Um, Gusto was my payroll company doing tasks for that. Um, I need to follow up with some like payments that still need to come in. Just random stuff like that that need to happen today as well, like figuring out healthcare for 2021. Um, but all of those can be done at home. So we're gonna start with the ones that have to be done here and we'll see how it goes. Okay, I have about 15 minutes before I need to leave for our little dentist appointment. Um, and I wanted to clean the office today, so I'm going to do that. It's pretty cl cluttery. Um, and there's just like some sweeping and stuff like that to do. So, let's do it. I'll try and do like before and after takes. These are going home to be washed. These are just a little bit more tidy. In the bathroom. Let's move into here. So the floor of this wall. For my hanging plant problem, um, and then I just need to give a good sweep um, of the whole place. But this is done now. Before <laughs> the sky, oh, so glittered. Let's do it. Now I just need to sweep and well, and we're good to go. Okay, we are um, just in time to head home and pick the boys up and drive straight to the dentist. Um, we are here. Obi is filling out the paperwork and we're it's like all um, COVID friendly so they like come out to your car um, Ford's got a, our little's got a mask on and um, all that stuff so it's I think it's gonna be it's it feels really like nice and comforting yeah. um, so you might hear Obi's class in the background so I wanted to let you know that I'm gonna make some lunch I'm doing one of these like daily harvest soups and this one is mushroom and miso here is what is in it um it's so easy and i really like them so i'm gonna do that and make a little sandwich to go on the side of it um that's all you need to know
Hello. So I am coming to you from the parking lot of the imaging center. I'm here to get a CT scan. Um, this is my fourth CT scan this year, I think, maybe fifth. Um, and we basically, I got sick in October of 2019 and am still not better. And we don't know why and we're trying to figure it out. So um, we're just kind of doing incremental CT scans to see if my lungs get clear. Um, so this is my quarterly scan. So I'm here for the scan today and then Friday I'll go see my pulmonologist and we'll kind of go over it and see what's going on um, or see if we have a guess as to what's going on. And um, yeah, that's all. That's what we're here to do. Um, after the CT scan is over, I have a meeting at 4.30 with a potential sponsor. Um, so we're going to hopefully I'll be out soon enough to like be home and settled but um if not I'll do it from the car we'll see what happens hopefully usually this is pretty quick and easy so we'll see so I am in the waiting room I've been in here like almost an hour um, which is crazy. That's super abnormal. Um, but I'm hoping they call me back soon and then I will be able to um, get, get out of here um, in time for my meeting. Oh, so cool. Um, we are out. Like Once I got in, it took me like maybe five minutes to even get the scan. That was like painless. It is 3.43. I have a meeting in... I needed that. I have a meeting in 45 minutes. So I'm going to head home, make some coffee, and sit down for my meeting. Hopefully I'll get to tell you who it was with um, afterwards, but we'll see. It's snowing! Oh, we got his birthday snow. It's really happening. I don't think you can see it. I am home in my nice warm house. It started snowing like right when I pulled in the garage. It's so exciting. Um, I'm gonna make some coffee. Um, this is Chamberlain coffee that my assistant Jenny, who I bought this shirt from, she's very infused in my life. Um, she sent this to me as a gift because she's amazing and um, so I'm going to um, make it <laughs> I'm so I'm, I'm ready for the day to be over okay I'm gonna make it um, and then while it's steeping I'm gonna talk to you about updates on the budget stuff that we talked about on Saturday Okay, so I wanted to talk to you about the changes, like the first few changes we made after kind of doing the budgeting thing on Saturday. So the first thing we did is we cut our weekly takeout spending down by, we were like half. Um, and then we just like created a takeout budget. So now every time we want to order takeout, we have to like think about it. Like, do we want, is this worth taking it out of our takeout budget? And that is already like, worked on my brain um and then we also created like a budget for how much we spend independently and then how much we spend together um and that's been awesome but the thing i'm most excited about today is um we signed up for this app called trim um where they will negotiate your bills for you and they've already negotiated a bill for us which was like our phone bill got it reduced by 30 dollars a month and then got us on a plan like saved us money and got us on a plan that included a lot of the streaming services that we use so that we don't even have to pay for those anymore so we're saving like 
more a month than we even thought we would be. So um, I thought that was really awesome. So the Trim is the app that we used and it's it's been really good. Um, I'll keep you guys updated as well as we make more changes um, moving forward. But so far, that was a good exercise. I feel like grateful for it. Um, like we have a plan and um, it feels nice. So I'm gonna let this coffee steep. Um, I also, while I was waiting on the doctor, worked on my um, foam background for the winter. I promised I would like do a winterizing. So I'm gonna like put it in here so you guys can kind of see the flip through of it. Basically, I use the app Widgetsmith and I just um, place them in. There's lots of tutorials on YouTube. Um, and I just pull pictures that inspire me and pick a theme and made it cohesive. Um, so that's been really fun as well. That's all for today or for right now. Um, I'm going to go meet with the folks I'm meeting with about a sponsorship and um, I'll see you afterward. schoolwork for a little bit and now I'm going to send my proposal over to the sponsor. Um, I think I can tell you guys. I'm We're working on a collaboration with Kitchen, the website, um, which I'm super pumped about because I'm like a really big fan and obsessed with them. So um, this feels like a really big deal. I'm really pumped. Um, I, so I just need to send them the proposal, kind of a rundown of what we talked about and what I'm thinking for our collaboration. And um, I think Obi's gonna make dinner tonight, even though it's it's technically my night to cook, but he's doing me a solid. Um, and then we'll get to finally like cozy, cozy it up. Um, I just sent my proposal over and that is the last thing that I have to do today. So I'm going to put on cozy clothes and edit you and get that scheduled for tomorrow and then i um obi's birthday is tomorrow and so i'm trying to figure out um what has to happen in order for like the day my day tomorrow to have been like successful so that i can be with him as much as possible um for his actual birthday um and take a load off of him in terms of parenting and stuff on the day so we can have a little bit more ease um but I don't know how much I don't know how much that's possible honestly I guess we'll find out tomorrow when you watch the vlog <laughs> so um but I just wanted to end it here um I will close off with a view of how our puzzle's coming along um in case those of you who are curious we did a decent amount yesterday and um, thanks for watching the vlog. I will see you tomorrow for day nine.